In this video, I'd like to introduce a couple of new pieces of hardware that I've received recently. Uh, the first one is this custom solar panel from lensunsolar.com. And uh, I guess what's special about it is its shape. So it's custom designed. I told them the dimensions that I wanted and they designed, uh, then produced and shipped the, the panel to me, all for quite a reasonable price. It was under uh, $200, including shipping. Uh, I guess also it is uh, flexible and waterproof, which is important for my use case. I'm going to be using it on a mapping boat. Now, it's not a particularly powerful panel. Uh, its maximum output is uh, 30 watts or 1.72 amps, um, which is not huge. Uh, but still, I'm expecting that if I do a long mapping mission, maybe four or five hours on the boat, I might get an extra 30 minutes or so of range out of it. The next piece of hardware I want to introduce is this Packet Digital MPPT solar charge controller. And this will allow me to charge my boat's battery uh, from the solar panel that I just showed you. Now, I guess what's special about this uh, solar charge controller is that it's very lightweight. So that's not, you know, hugely important on my boat, but if you were going to use this on, say, an airplane, that could be quite, quite important. Um, also, it's configurable, so you can change the output voltage to anywhere from 12 volts to 50 volts. So you can use it on a 3S system, uh, all the way up to a 10S system. And finally, it's got this uh, drone can interface, so you can connect this to your autopilot. That's where you can do that configuration. Um, but it also means you can set up ArduPilot to use this device as a battery monitor, so you can see exactly how much power the uh, solar panel is, is providing, and then you can subtract that from the um, or perhaps add that to the battery capacity so you know exactly how much range you've still got in your vehicle. Okay, next I'm going to uh, hitch this all up and show you that it actually works. Okay, so I've got it all connected up now. So the solar panel is uh, connected to the V-in of the uh, Packet Digital solar charge controller. The battery is connected to the V-out uh, and the autopilot is connected to the drone can interface. And over here on the mission planner, I'm seeing that the solar panel is producing anywhere from 1.1 to 1.5 amps. So that is pretty good.